give you a few tips about how to communicate with your lender where, when you are in the process of uh, getting a loan modification or another workout uh, from your bank. So basically, you have to uh, keep in mind that a bank is a financial institution and that this financial institution uh, lends you money. Uh, even if uh, the person you are dealing with is actually only a servicer and it's uh, an investor that holds your loan, that servicer uh, is in charge of uh, collecting the money that you borrowed and uh, transferring it to the person that borrowed it from you, that borrowed it to you, I'm sorry. Um, so basically, you have to keep that in mind when you speak with them, that it's only legitimate that when you borrowed money, you have to repay that money. But uh, you should not let yourself uh, impress that much uh, by that because a key, a key point to the success of your modification request, for example, is showing that modification is at your best advantage but also at the best advantage of the bank. So if we are successful, uh, you and us, into proving that the cost of modification is uh, lower than the cost of foreclosure in your specific case, then it makes sense to that bank. Uh, these are words that actually uh, appeal to them in a way. What I also want you to be aware is that in the process of following up with your bank and communicating with your bank, you may uh, be confronted to uh, very different departments within that bank and uh, I'm going to speak about two of them, uh, the collections department and the loss mitigation department within a bank. Collections, um, these people actually uh, are here to collect on your debt. So they're not the most uh, open-minded people for uh, loan modification if you're trying to get one. Their purpose is to get the money back and this is how they operate. This is uh, the type of answer that you're going to get from them. Uh, when you ask them what type of help is possible for you, most of the time they will uh, ask you to go under a repayment plan. But as opposed to collections, there's another department you may be confronted to is the loss mitigation department. And the loss mitigation department is actually the people you want to be interacting with because they're the people who are going to make um, decisions about your loan modification request. They're the people who are going to analyze the cost, the cost of modification as opposed to the cost of foreclosure. Uh, they are the people who are actually more open-minded about loss mitigation tool, which means uh, trying to reduce the loss for the bank as opposed to the collections department. So when you call your bank, be very specific uh, about being transferred to the loss mitigation department and make sure that you're talking to these people. Then uh, you also have to understand that even though you have applied for a modification, uh, collections will continue. They will not stop. The only time collections effort will stop is either when you're going to bring your loan current or you're going to have a final modification. Until then, unfortunately, you're going to be receiving the calls from the collections department asking you, where is the money?